Hey, what's up you guys? It's Caboose bringing you another Mortal Kombat 11 video and today what I got for you guys here is something extremely exciting. Mortal Kombat 11 Aftermath. The official trailer is out and we are absolutely gonna be doing a reaction to it. I am so excited to see what this is all about. I'm just... Oh my goodness, I'm giddy, I'm giddy. But before we get to my reaction, I wanted to ask you guys, of course, if you could leave a like rating on the video as it shows your support, and I would really appreciate it. So if you could leave a like, especially for the hype of Mortal Kombat 11 Aftermath, that would be much appreciated. And with that said, I don't want to waste too much more time. Our work is finished, Liu Kang. Okay. Lord Raiden, this is what we've seen. You to architect a new history. This is what we've seen. Together, let us begin. <laughs> Cease, Liu Kang, before you do oh man. So. Is that Fujin? You destroy her crown. Without it, you can't restart history. Oh my god. 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 Carry frickin' Tagawa. This is so sick. This is so sick. Oh, uh, that's freaking Fujin. Oh my god. Oh, he looks so sick. Yo, it's a new stage. Yo, the Deadpools. The Soul Chamber. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so hype. Oh, Shiva. No way. Got that Goro influence. I'm seeing it. I like it. I like it. I mean, obviously. That looks so sick. Damn. Oh, she's got a shield. Oh. oh my god. They got a story DLC with all the freaking DLC characters. And they're bringing in new characters. Yo. Shang Tsung. Oh my god. Oh, stage fatalities? Stage fatalities? This is too much. <laughs> this is amazing. This is amazing. No one can predict what happens next. Not even me. I can predict that I'm hype. No. You are under arrest, dirtbag. <laughs> what? What? Oh man. Oh. Oh my God! They got friendships. Yo! What? What? They got the Deception Sub Zero? And they got MK9 Scorpion in there? Classic Frost Tooth. Whatever, whatever. But. Oh, man! Oh, my God. I need to collect myself. That was so hype. I haven't felt this kind of hype since I think, like, the gameplay reveal last year. Oh, my God. Oh, that was awesome. That was awesome. Wow, Fujin. Fujin, Robocop. We need to watch this again, okay? Let me collect myself, and we're going to watch this again. <laughs> okay, now that I've calmed down a little bit, I'm going I'm to watch it again. We're going to try and get a little more of an idea of what's going on. Because I have no idea. I honestly wasn't following too much about like the story. I was just so extremely hype about Fujin. Okay, so the story, it looks like it's literally right after the last cutscene of the game. That's interesting. Oh, okay. That's super interesting. 
Damn, okay, so Shang Tsung... Oh my god, oh my god. Look how friggin' cool he looks. Look how friggin' cool he looks. Oh my god, that Kamui's going so high up! The Soul Chamber, the Deadpools... Shiva's stomping on you, like, that's crazy. She actually looks pretty fun, I can't lie. I'm not, like, as hyped as I am for Fujin, of course. But she looks pretty cool. And the shield, that should be interesting. That's new. So they bring back Sindel for this as well. It, so it looks like they're bringing back all the DLC, or at least a majority of the MK DLC characters from Combat Pack 1. Or actually, I think it's all of them. Um, and then they're introducing new characters here with Shiva and Fujin. Stage fatalities, friendships, new stages, story DLC, new characters. This is the kind of content that we're looking for here. This is awesome. Netherrealm has never done something like this before. It's always just, you know, here's another combat pack or here's another pack of characters. This time they're like giving us a full on expansion. Although I will be honest, I don't want to fight Kronika again as the final boss of this DLC. I hope the final boss of the DLC is Shang Tsung. I hope he does some craziness and he tries to double cross us. Robocop, man. What the hell is that about? Hold on. Freaking Robocop. Are you telling me in MK11 I could have Robocop fighting the Terminator? I wonder if that's Peter Weller. Like doing everything. Kind of sounds like him. This, I, someone get me this song too, please. Because that really adds up to the hype. So hold on. Let's see here. Um, okay. So a new cinematic story, three new characters, three new skin packs. Oh, three new skin packs. So we've only seen just one. Um, we got... Okay, in the, there's, an, there's an expansion version and the collection version, I guess, which comes with the game and the Aftermath expansion. So stage fatalities, friendships, new stages arriving in a free update. Oh, May 26th. That's awesome. So the new stages, the uh, the friendships, and uh, and the stage fatalities are all free. It's just obviously if you want to get the new characters, you want to get the new story, that's the paid expansion. That is awesome. Yo, nobody's doing it like Netherrealm is. Seriously, nobody is doing it like Netherrealm is out there. I got to give them credit where credit is due. This is freaking amazing. And the friendship... The scorpion friendship. I love that. Hugging a giant teddy bear. Oh, man. But this. This got me almost more hype than anything. Simply because of the Sub-Zero skin. The Mortal Kombat deception. Crazy, like, samurai looking Sub-Zero. I don't know why they chose that mask, though. And same with Scorpion. He has the MK9 mask a part of his gear. I don't know why they didn't just select that. But either way. Either way. All of this. So extremely hype. And it's right around the corner. May 26th, right? Well, that's what it said here. So, I'm assuming if the stages and everything are coming May 26th, I'm guessing that's that's the release date. May 26th. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Alright. Uh, now I gotta kick it to you guys. Let me know your thoughts on all this in the comment section below. Are you hyped for Mortal Kombat 11 Aftermath? And are you hyped as I am to see Fujin in this game? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed my reaction, if you could leave a like rating on the video, it shows your support. And I would really appreciate it. I'm Caboose. And you can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel. Or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description. Drop a like if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment if you have an opinion. And subscribe if you're new. See you guys later.